positive charges. For the most part, all of my life I've been a happy person with a good positive mental attitude. I stated for the most part because it took me many years to understand the importance of finding a true peace of mind of happiness. To me, this knowledge is a true definition of success. I also had to realize the importance of consistently working at developing and maintaining a positive mental attitude. I soon realized that my attitude was the most single powerful force that I possessed. According to a study by executive recruiters at Harvard University, 85% of everything a person accomplishes after the university in a way of wealth, position, or status was a result of attitude. Only 15% was a result of aptitude or ability. Alan Cox, the author in the Cox Report of the American Corporation, found that by surveying top executives of the Fortune 500 companies, 94% of those surveyed attributed their success to attitude than any other single factor. Positive Charges 544 Ways to Stay Upbeat During Downbeat Times Positive, free from doubt or hesitation, confident, optimistic, attitude, a way of acting or behaving that shows what one is thinking or feeling, positive attitude, free from doubt or hesitation, confident, optimistic way of acting or behaving that shows what one is thinking or feeling. Choose your friends carefully. A negative attitude is very contagious and can rub off on you little by little without your knowledge. Number one, look forward, not backwards. Be a leader, not a follower. Focus on your successes and learn from your failures. Stay away from people who try to belittle your ambitions. Trust your hopes, not your fears. Go the extra mile at your job. Attitude is everything. Attitude is the way you think. Your attitude is something other people can actually see. They can hear it in your voice, see it in the way you move, and feel it when you are with you, when they are with you. Your attitude expresses itself in everything you do. All the time, wherever you are, positive attitudes are always inviting positive results. Negative attitudes always invite negative results. Attitude makes a difference in everything you do for your entire life, every hour of every day. What you get out of each thing that you do will be equal to the attitude that you have when you do it. Anything that you do with a positive attitude will work for you. Anything that you do with a negative attitude will work against you. If you have a positive attitude, you will look for ways to solve problems that you can that you can solve and you will let go of the things from which you have no control you can develop a positive attitude by emphasizing the good by being tough-minded and by refusing defeat develop high values remember you can if you think you can the biggest mistake that you can make is to be afraid of making one look at the challenges in your life as stepping stones to success if you want respect have self-respect Act. Don't react. Humans can, by their thoughts and acts of will, considerably influence their feelings, health, and even their chemistry. This is the truth behind the effectiveness of positive thinking. Start today and put your ideas into action. Expect positive outcomes every day. If what you're doing now isn't providing you with a sense of satisfaction, then change what you are doing. Always look your best. Finish what you start. Learn to laugh at yourself. Begin each day with a personal outlook that will open doors, welcome opportunity, and bring serenity. Your attitude determines your ability to experience success and happiness. Be consistent. Determine that success really means to you. Determine what it means to you. Then put your thoughts in writing. Analyze and evaluate the attitudes of current friends and associates. Always have alternative, alternative plans. Believe yourself. Believe in yourself and what you are doing. Focus on your efforts, on constant achievement. A positive mental attitude urges you to seek the truth, take constructive action, strive to achieve the highest ideals that you can conceive, consistent with your good physical and mental health, live intelligently in your society, abstain from which you will cause unnecessary injury, start from where you are and go to where you want to be regardless of what you are or what you have been, do little, do a little more each day than you think you possibly can. Change the thoughts you hold in your mind and you change your life. Be decisive. Build a positive attitude of expectancy. Refuse to be discouraged. Don't try to win arguments. By building and maintaining a positive mental attitude, you can achieve results that you never dreamed were possible. Always find the best in people. And if you make up your mind that you can't, you'll always be right. Remember that we first make our habits and then our habits make us. Don't be afraid to be yourself. Speak and write using positive words. Open the door to new friends. Whether glass is half full or half empty depends on the attitude of the person looking at it. Build and develop your self-confidence. Have faith in yourself. Your future will be what you mentally picture it to be. Your life is a blackboard. 
Pick up the chalk and write out what you want. Keep learning new things every day of your life. It is our attitude at the beginning of a difficult undertaking, which is more than anything else, which more than anything else will determine its successful outcome. Understand that you are your biggest competitor. Don't be sick. Don't sit back and take what comes. Go after what you want. Help people like themselves. Stretch outside your comfort zone. Resist the temptation to judge others. And never surrender to external forces. People can alter their lives by altering their attitudes. Believe in your own brilliance. Build a reputation as a winner. In order to change, you must be sick and tired of being sick and tired. Start out each day by focusing on the positive aspects of your job. Set aside time every day to a daydream. Expect big things from your life. Our life is a reflection of our attitudes. Be willing to accept occasional small setbacks. Happiness doesn't depend on what you have. It depends on how you feel about what you have. Try harder. Stop wishing and start resolving. Learn to act immediately. Learn to act immediately upon a decision. Keep raising your expectations. You are the sole master of your attitude. Begin each day with a motivational self-talk. Face fears head on. Develop close relationships. Take time each day to give yourself an, an attitude check. Dare to aim high. Keep your promises. This may shock you, but I believe the single most significant decision I can make on a day-to-day -day basis is my choice of attitude. It is more important than my past, my education, my bankroll, my success or failures, fame or pain, what other people think of me or say about me, my circumstances or my position. Attitude is that single string that keeps me going or cripples my progress. It alone fuels my fire or assaults my hope. When my attitudes are right. There's no barrier too high, no valley too deep, no dream too extreme, no challenge too great for me. I am convinced that life is 10% what happens to me and 90% of how I react to it. And so it is with you. We are in charge of our attitudes. Learn to recognize the signs of tomorrowitis. Make your mistakes. Learn from them. Move on. What happens in you is more important than what happens to you. Spend more time socializing. Like what you do and like what you do and then do it well. Learn to be a good listener. Attitudes are much more important than aptitudes. Stretch your imagination. Learn to see other people's viewpoints. Give others your enthusiastic attention. Take control of your attitude. Don't let someone else control it for you. Be supportive to others and to the achievements of their goals. Learn to improvise. Attitude is the mind's paintbrush. It can color any situation. Keep your minds filled with thoughts of happiness, hope, peace, courage. Set aside time every day for solitude and reflection. Understand that there is only a letter difference between change and chance. Make choices between being reactive and being creative. Your living is determined not so much as by what life brings to you as much as the attitude that you bring to life. The more do more for the world than the world does for you. Be thankful for each day. Count your blessings instead of your problems. Never believe that you don't have what it takes. Don't forget to laugh often. Think before acting. Seek happiness. The good news is that the bad news can be turned into good news when you change your attitude. Learn to accept fair criticism without resentment. Laugh with people, never at them. Develop love where hate has been. Recognize the inevitable. Eliminate envy from your life. Realize that your dreams of the future are better than the history of the past. Let us think positively and remember that the misfortunes that the misfortunes hardest to bear are those which rarely happen. Don't look for faults. Find remedies. Develop your intuition. Create a self-fulfilling prophecy of winning and success. Take responsibility for the past, present, and future experiences. If you don't know, say so. Inspire others by your positive example. A positive attitude is a state of mind which is maintained each day through optimism, enthusiasm, and a belief in oneself and in one's true potential. Recognize the power of your thoughts and increase the value of your ideas. Avoid someday aisle syndrome. Don't take the path of least resistance. Realize that the biggest risk in life is is to do nothing. Be forgiving towards others. Always expect the unexpected. Attitude is the window through which you must see the world. 
Get rid of the fear of failure. Master your morale. Believe that if it's meant to be, it is up to me. Replace a negative habit with two positive habits. Understand that the choices you make today will shape your future. Praise yourself every day. Hardening of the attitudes is the most deadly disease on the face of the earth. Search for ways in which it can be done instead of looking for reasons it can't be done. Stop studying your mistakes. Concentrate on studying your achievements and successes. Ask yourself, if I could do anything I wanted to do in my life, what would it be? Write it down and go for it. Learn how to manage your time more effectively. Discipline yourself and eliminate procrastination. Don't become addicted to the dependent or dependent on negativism, you may be a negaholic. Pursue life with a positive outlook. Be compassionate. Never condemn in others from what you see and know is in yourself. Stand up for what you believe. Tonight, look up at the stars. Don't let imaginary obstacles block you from getting what you want. A positive mental attitude is the right mental attitude for each specific occasion. It has the power to attract the good and the beautiful. A negative attitude repels people and will rob you of all that makes life worth living. Be aware of the thoughts that you occupy, you occupy in your mind. Keep them positive. Dedicate at least 30 minutes a day to creative visualization. Invest in yourself. That's where you'll receive the best interest. Recognize that you've had troubles before and you've managed to survive them. Positive attitude is not a destination, it's a way of life. Seek out mentors and colleagues that will help you live your dreams. Be a positive and aggressive listener. Change worry, change worry time into planning time. Spend this weekend doing something you really want to do. Determine your values in life and admit your mistakes. Attitudes are contagious. Is yours worth catching? Become a world-class prioritizer. Take time to be friendly. Recognize that your attitude is most is your most priceless possession. Build a reputation for delivering more than you promised. Control your temper. Rise early, work late, and strike oil. Our only limitations are those from which we set up in our minds or permit others to establish for us. Develop positive behavior. Learn to listen to others and learn from them. Devote some time to community support. It is better to do something imperfectly than to do nothing perfectly. Learn to spot opportunities and seize them courageously. Take time out to enjoy the sunset. It takes but one positive thought when given a chance to survive and thrive to overpower an entire army of negative thoughts. Help yourself by helping others. Simplify your life. Always strive to become the most knowledgeable person in your field. Set up a target for your career and aim for it. Follow your dominant desires. Look towards the future. When you have accepted the worst, we have nothing more to lose. And that automatically means that we have everything to gain. Concentrate on your assets, not your limitations. Keep an open mind. Make amends with enemies and let your body language convey positive things about you. Work smarter, not harder. Take pride in your work. Your morning thoughts may determine the conduct of the day. Optimistic thoughts will make your day bright and productive, while pessimistic thinking will make it dull and wasteful. Face each day cheerfully, smilingly, courageously, and it will naturally follow that in the work that will be real and a pleasure, a progress that will be delightful and accomplishment. Replace fear with desire. Always get a good night's sleep. Re relinquish all excuses from your life. Treat yourself as if you are the most important asset that you will ever own. Respect other people's opinions, even if they're different from your own. Accept 100% responsibility for your life. Remember, a positive attitude produces a positive perception and changes the situation for the better. Use your material gains in ways that will benefit others. Begin each day by planting positive seeds of thought. Welcome challenges, for they are the real stimulators to success. Take time to look at yourself through other people's eyes. More positive charges. We are born with a positive mental attitude. We learn to be negative. Avoid jumping to conclusions until you know all the facts. Live your dreams, not someone else's. Define your purpose in life and write it down. Invest a percentage of your annual income into personal and professional development. Don't m major in minor things. Choose to love and be loved. Positive thinking is a hope that you can move mountains. Positive believing is the same hope, but with a reason for believing that you can do it. Try smiling. 
smiling while you're using the phone. Never think down. Always think up. Set aside a period of quietness every day. Think only the best. Work only for the best. Expect only the best. Make it a habit to give yourself credit for your accomplishments. Listen for truth and speak the truth. Ability is what you're capable of doing. Motivation determines what you do. Attitude determines how well you do it.